I'm Yolande Poirier from Oracle Technology Network, and I'm here today at DevOx talking to Cecilia Bohr. Hi. Hi. <laughs> so you are working on OpenJDK. Tell us about um, what is the, the program. Uh, OpenJDK is a way to drive the implementation of a Java platform in the open as open source. Uh, so Sun was doing this, and now Oracle took it, uh, took it over. And we've been doing this since 2006. So what is new in uh, OpenJDK? Uh, right now we're focusing uh, on getting information out there so that developers can join the open source, um, the open source project. Uh, the Java platform is huge. Uh, and uh, to a lot of people, I think it's uh, too big to uh, start. But it's really divided in, into 20 different groups and uh, 40 different projects. So it's easy to, um, to just come onto a mailing list and see what's happening. There. So what can, what can developers uh, do? I think the first thing uh, developers should do just to see what it is, is to subscribe to one of the mailing lists. On openjdk.java.net, all the mailing lists are listed. And it's easy to just subscribe and then to see what's happening and what is being discussed. And then you'll quickly get to know all the other people on that project or on that group. And you can see if it's something that interests you. And then what is the next step? Uh, one, and one then uh, you can actually do some contributions through the mailing list, suggest smaller things, or smaller bug fixes. And then after that, the next step uh, would be to contribute something bigger. And then you need to sign up uh, for a contributor uh, agreement and then start checking out the code and uh, start contributing real features and bug fixes. Can you, for example, suggest a um, new project, or who can do that? Um, yeah, I, I would say start with uh, discussing on the mailing lists, okay. and then um, start to contribute and talk to the others. And after all, we have a, a good set of game rules uh, to understand how to level up uh, in, in this uh, thing. And as a starter, if you have new ideas and discussing them, someone else will pick it up and suggest it as uh, new projects and, I and ideas. So how does it relate to um, open, uh, so to other program like um, um, to contribute to a JSR or to, uh, to other activities that... Uh oh, yes. Yeah, so uh, the community are driving two brilliant programs, adopt a JSR and adopt OpenJDK to make it easier for Java user groups and individuals to get closer to these projects. So for example, Adopt OpenJDK uh, are driving hackathons or hack nights or bugathons, uh, something that you can do in your Java user group um, to make it easy for people to try OpenJDK out. So gather 20 developers for a night or a Saturday, set up the infrastructure uh, and get some, just find some trivial bugs, uh, build warnings, for example, uh, fix those and then submit them. Uh, and during a couple of hours, uh, developers has tri have tried it out. Uh, they've seen the code source. They've got to learn how some of the processes work and uh, seen the code and got familiar with it and see that it, if it's something for them. So it's a very simple way in a, just a couple of hours to get the hang of what it is. What else can they do? Or what else would you like to share with, uh, with the community? You had a session yeah. today. What did you cover during that session? Uh, I tried to explain the basics of OpenJDK uh, to make sure that people understand that it's, it's not as frightening as it seems. We have 400 um, registered people on OpenJDK, but a lot more people are actually contributing on uh, mailing lists and so on. Uh, and uh, and that it's divided into smaller groups and projects. So even if it's a huge platform, you can still find the area of interest for you. Um, and then also to point at the brilliant community programs that it can actually lead you into this, like adopt OpenJDK uh, open and adopt at JSR.
Are there any companies also contributing? Or oh, yes. Yeah. So right now, um, we're heavily focusing on infrastructure to make sure that it's easy for developers to, to build. I would say um, a year ago, building and setting up your configuration was for advanced developers. But now it's as easy as typing make. Uh, and that we have been working heavily on that to make local builds really easy. Now it's all the other things, how to test your code when you, how to see that your code actually don't break anything. And that's also important. And that's a community project um, that we're doing together with individuals, with uh, Java user groups, uh, with the other companies like IBM and Red Hat. And I think all the bigger companies and everyone is seeing how important this is uh, for Java survival in the future. So everyone, everyone's in on it. So, and what is the, the website? Uh, where do you? OpenJDK.java.net. Great. Yeah. Thank you for talking to us yeah. today. No problem. Thank you.